my name's Gary Shinfield and um, I moved to the Blue Mountains four and a half years ago from the centre of Sydney and the reason I moved here was because I'm an artist and I was looking for a peaceful place to be able to uh, carry on as an artist and also a place that would provide inspiration and beauty for workshops which I also run in the arts. Um, also as part of our business we have uh, a holiday cottage next door um, and that provides casual accommodation to people that come from various places internationally uh, but mainly from Sydney and the holiday cottage has been extremely successful for about two and a half years now uh, it's rented out for about a third of the year and gives us an income um, and people come here because they like the peace and quiet um, uh, this is a spacious property it's located close to bushland and um, it's always uh, valued by um, those that want to get out of Sydney and the rat race and come to this part of the world for rejuvenation. Now, this particular space that I'm standing in, a large room, uh, I've set up as a gallery to uh, exhibit my work and the work of other artists. And uh, I also have uh, exhibitions here occasionally. Um, and people will come from Sydney, my previous contacts and workmates will come, people that are interested in my art, and uh, we sell work from um, the house as well. Uh, as well, I show work in uh, galleries within Sydney. Um, the workshops, I source people locally, um, but, but also contacts come from Sydney as well. And usually the workshops involve six to twelve people. They stay in the cottage for the weekend or for four to five days on site. And what I do is take them into the bush because the whole idea of the workshop is to make them aware of the beauty of this particular part of the world. And the point, the, the place where I take them is Point Pilcher. We, we walk into the National Park, we set up at the end at the point and uh, we draw, paint, photograph in the morning, come back and work in the studio in the afternoon. Now, the workshops are extremely successful. Um, we always find people that are wanting to, wanting to do them. And there's one thing that I've noticed, because I've spent much time down at Point Pilcher, is that I can hear people speak at Evans Lookout. It is that close. To get to Point Pilcher, people may not know that you have to drive beside the proposed airstrip. The idea of helicopters coming in um, and the noise that, that they will create, or small planes in the future, will, for us, make it not an enjoyable place to be for art workshops. The silence, um, the solitude that it provides will be shattered. And I'm also very concerned about my business here in the mountains, both the rental of the cottage and um, people that come to work with me in my studio. Will it be as enjoyable and as desirable if it is commercialised? 